Hey, what's going on guys? So today we're talking about utility knives and uh, more specifically the blades. So I got a couple of blades here from work. I just swapped these blades out. These are the old ones that were in this uh, Civivi as well as this knife, which we'll talk about in a second. I got this from uh, Arena Accessories. Very, very cool titanium handle. So yeah, I mean, you can see these are pretty beat from work. Um, I go through blades a lot now because I'm doing a lot of cutting, a lot of random stuff. I'm all over the place. Um, I do love my OTF one, which is still at work at the moment. But I have the uh, little uh, mini Civivi here, the kind of mini Elementum or short Elementum with, of course, the uh, Civivi blade in there, which came with a couple packs. When I first got this knife, I put just some regular Stanley blades, but I forgot I even had the pack. And I just recently found it, had to swap out, so I did. In this case, you have to undo the screw, which is kind of a pain. Uh, any utility knife, um, I much prefer easy quick like you know hold down a lever push a thing push a button take the blade out you can flip it around real quick i mean that's what i want when i'm at work i have an edge that's not really performing i want to flip it quick time is of the essence it's not like uh you know when i'm home it's different i, I can take leisurely you know grab a different um you know different blade and you know undo the screw got my nice little screwdriver i don't mind that stuff at home but at work it really is boom 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 you gotta go so the only drawback with this so far has been that. Now, I do like the small form factor. It works totally fine. A lot of times I'm gripping in higher anyway when I'm cutting stuff. Um, it's a little short in the handle, but it's kind of meant to be that way. So it's kind of more compact overall. This guy from Arena Accessories is the bomb. It's awesome. It's called a flip out. You can see it there. All right. And uh, titanium handle. So we have the whole pocket knife experience, only we have the um you know replaceable blades there this one of course is a flipper just like the civivi with the civivi i mean a lot of times i am flipping it but then the button lock's nice to close it this has a frame lock not a big deal though i do you know i'm so used to frame locks i've literally had thousands of them but you know equal uh size overall so very similar experience in using these two just a little bit uh obviously different here and there this one you unscrew right here so this is literally a, it's a large screw so it's a little easier than having to find a tool for it. And I can, with the uh, little jimping that's here, let me show you that closer, sorry. With the little jimping, you can get a good grip to really tighten that down so it's not gonna uh, fall out or get loose on you. Uh, but if you lost that screw, you're, you're kind of screwed. <laughs> so it's quicker access to uh, flip a blade or replace a blade than the Civivi, uh, but still not as quick as, you know, like the OTF I have from Tack Knives, that is just, I mean, you push down the lever, you flip it, that's it, it's like half a second. So, uh, yeah, the reason I want to make this video is not so much about these knives, but really about the blades. I'm curious where you get your blades and what are your favorite blades? Now, for me, for work, doesn't matter. Anything, anything, everything, as long as it's sharp. I've had, you know, different brands blades. Um, I've used the uh, serrated ones before. I've used the, you know, little hook blades. I mean, it doesn't matter because once they go dull, I swap them out, but it's not like... I have a preference and that's what I'm kind of looking forward to is your comments if you're like really like if you use these things for years and years and you're like yeah these blades suck these blades are good that's the info that's the feedback I'm looking to get not only for myself but anyone else watching this and reading the comments so if you have a favorite blade that just really is above all and you're like man no these are the blades they're worth the money I'm definitely one of the people who would pay a little extra for a quality tool and as far as these blades go yeah obviously it's inconvenient that's the point of talking about this a little inconvenient to change them on the fly so i want them to last longer i want a better edge now i'm not aware of any company making this style utility blade but in higher end steels like s30v or anything like that like that would be really really cool maybe that exists and i never heard of it maybe it doesn't maybe it's an idea maybe you should go start a gofundme and make that happen <laughs> everyone's favorite blade steels you can just put in these utility style blades have a mass produced you know at a decent price and they would be wildly popular I would imagine everyone would want them. I know I would want them, and I would pay extra for those. Uh, so I'm curious if that even exists. But if it doesn't, uh, I'm curious what you guys prefer, especially the tradesmen out there, you know, the contractors, the plumbers, the electricians. What are you guys using year after year? You know, you've tried these, you've tried those. They're not worth it getting a, you know, 100-pack for $25 or whatever. That's just junk, right? It's not about quantity, it's about quality. So I'm asking you, what is the quality utility blades? What do you guys like? And then for your fun knives for home, I've seen blades with like different etching, like, you know, Damascus and stuff and different designs on it, which is kind of cool. It's a way to customize your personal EDC. But again, that's more home stuff as opposed to work stuff. But yeah, that's all. Just looking for feedback on your favorite utility blades.
that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Take care.